Hey guys and girls, uh, my name is Snowy and welcome to this little tutorial video about what you can do if you have two big intersections close to each other or any intersection whatsoever. So this is something probably you will see happen, you know, when there is like little space in between. You only have one node. Now you have like, for example, the guys who are coming from here, they want to dive maybe here so they dive down three lanes and the ones that are coming from here as you can see they are just blocking it up i pause the game and they're going from here to the third lane so how can you combat this there are two options there are two options first of all you can try to add another node that's one thing let's say you don't have that option just for the sake of it because i want to show you something first now it's about the nodes that are here on this spot. You can see how this traffic is going. It's going not very well. You can see it's all backing up. Let's see, all the way up to here. Now I have to also say like playing with despawn mode off so nobody is disappearing. So remember, let's remember this. Let me put here a marker. Uh, let's say a tree or something, you know, a big tree. Uh, let's say like this. Here we had our, you know, this was the line where the traffic was. Okay, let's let's keep that in mind. Okay, now what I'm going to do here is we're going to make the transfer of changing lanes easier. Now, how do you do it? You are using the mod called Node Controller. If you click this mod, then you can select the node, which is apparently here, because here they are lane cha lane changing. So we can use the move it mod to shift it over a little bit so we can bring it a little bit to the middle roughly like that and then you click the node controller again and then you can click this node like that yeah and then here you select custom now what does this do it makes it wider it makes the node wider now you can even make it more wider by dragging these apart yeah, so you drag these further that way, you drag these further that way. Yeah, okay. Now, let's say you have these lane connectors in place here, and the blue one, you know, too bad. Yeah, too bad for him. We press Shift S or Control S, and look how long these lines are in comparison to, for example, here. Here they are much shorter. Now, because these lines are much longer, the traffic has more opportunity to change lanes but how are we going to do it exactly is and then I'm going to tell you because uh, if I'm right let's say if these guys are coming come from here they still have like a node here to choose or not no those are forced into this lane and these guys they come here they cannot get into the right lane yeah okay but let's assume let's assume they can now what you can do you take the lane connectors and you say basically to these guys over here you are only allowed one up and you are allowed only one down no let's assume that you also have done this no now i know there should be a node here also so that these guys can change lanes because otherwise everybody who comes from this direction dives into this lane and they cannot change lanes so I assume they approach this this node from you know either the left lane or the right lane so we can use also the node controller correction the network multi tool and we press the plus button and we say like okay we're going to put an extra node there right right so what will happen now is that by doing so these guys are able to get to the in lane here and here they have more space yeah, to uh, to lane switch because this node is now much wider so well, the only way how we can prove this is just by unpause the game and let's see what happens. So he's, th <laughs> he's thinking a little bit like, okay, what to do? Okay, come on, go away. Can you drive on? <laughs> okay, 
Hey, can you drive on? Come on. Leaving the city. Uh, come on. Is that because I added that note? <laughs> this, is, this is fun. Okay, let me remove you. Let me remove you. And you. And you. And you. And you. Yeah. Well. A little bit faster, please. Today. So why is why why are these guys not moving? Oh wait a second! Oh here they come! Oh this also uh, disappeared. Okay. Now they are driving on. Okay. Now of course uh, further on into the game you can you know meet meet other uh, traffic because I'm playing with these one off. Uh, let me check this. Yeah that's okay. I play some hotels and stuff around here. Some some all kinds of thingies. Hotel. Let me see what kind of stuff we have over here. London Aquatic Center, the big luxury hotel, the pink casino, uh, I think this is the transport tower, we put like a casino hotel here, this thing is like a Club Anastasia, uh, what's this, this is like uh, another private luxury hotel and of course an after that dark mosque including with Space Cowboys 90s, okay, nice, so where were we, we were over here, where these guys can lane change now much easier. The question is now like where's the traffic? Here are the trees. All that traffic is now gone. Simply because you stretched the node. You stretched the node. It made the traffic it has more you can see how they flow into each other from left to right. Uh, ignored that uh, extra traffic over there, but this is the way how you can do it guys. I mean it does not need to be that difficult Now the other way what you can do Let's pause the game is like okay imagine you have this situation okay, You go there and you have this one node there now you can also use the network multi-tool and We are going to first remove this node Yeah, and then we are going to add Two nodes, so one there and one there. Yeah. Now we are going to put these what back in place there and there, and basically now they have, you see, two nodes. So let's pray, play, not pray. Well, pray as well. <laughs> and also, this is a way of doing things, but it, it depends a little bit on your situation. Um, you can also apply this, you know, in in urban situations where it's very busy, but I would recommend this situation, this a little bit more than this, because here, you know, if, if the, the lane connectors, if you connect them here, like that, th these are very short, short pieces of road where traffic can change their lanes. So I would rather say, grab the node controller, click it, select custom, and then drag these apart so that everybody can carry on. And that's just the way I would do it. Um, here, for example, you can also see here how they sometimes you see they are like doing that, you know, and they have little space to do so. And here you can also select the node controller. You click this, uh, you go to custom, you can drag this a little bit apart. Okay, you have to be a, be a little bit careful what you're doing because you are here working on a intersection. But by dragging this a little bit apart, now see how it goes now. They have now more space to basically change lanes. And actually it goes pretty much better. I mean this traffic is now flowing way more better into each other. As you can see. So that's the uh, the general idea guys and girls. And uh, I hope you uh, can do something useful with this information. Uh, I will put the link uh, to the mod in the description below. And if, if you have any questions left. Feel free to add, question uh, them to me in the comment section and I will say happy gaming. Okay guys, thank you for watching. Hit the uh, notification bell, subscribe, anything, that stuff and you will see more of this kind of videos. Okay.